Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel! If you're new here, my name is Medita and I'm, I'm very bored right now and this is a very spontaneous YouTube video because I'm feeling quirky, different, not like other girls. I need to stop talking. Um, I'm about to TIY something. If you don't know what TIY is, TIY stands for try it yourself because, you know, DIY says do it yourself but we are more of a try it yourself channel because the probability of me failing is usually very high so we are not gonna say do it yourself because doing means completing and we're just trying. Anyways, it's already seven o'clock. That's what I mean. Like I've been contemplating doing this all day and now I'm just like, Medita, you gotta do it. So basically what we're doing in today's video or tonight's video is I saw on Pinterest some sprayed edges of books, right? How do I explain? I'm just gonna show you. Stuff like this. You see, you see how like the, the pages are, like the edges are sprayed? I wanna do this. I wanna do this my own, by my, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna do this. I wanna spray some book edges right now. And because I'm bored and I don't have anything to do tonight, we are going to be spraying the edges of some of my favorite books. <laughs> and I'm very excited, I'm very hyped. We are going to be doing my first bookish challenge ever, which is, Combining art and books into one thing. I'm very excited. So yeah, let me put you guys here for a second so I can show you which books I want to like Spray the edges or like color them I also need to ride home and get the color though because I don't have any color here and I'm not about to buy any new colors These are my three um, Victims test object one is Shadow and Bone by Lee Bardugo. My brain, my artist brain is like, you know, it's tingling, okay? It's giving me lots of ideas. So I'm thinking like the dark night, the nice dark blue that we have going on right now. And then with like, with a golden fade maybe. And then on the side here, I'll do like the... Number two, this is the one we're gonna be starting off with. It's gonna be Verity by Colleen Hoover. And I'm thinking of doing a very basic black greenish fade and then doing um, letters here from the manuscript. And then my third victim of tonight is Nightfall. We're gonna see what we wanna do with Will Grayson. I'm praying for myself that I won't be failing too hard. I don't know how you do this really. I only know that you need to apply pressure on the top and bottom so the paint doesn't run in between the pages. We're gonna have to be using thick, thick, thick paint. Thick like my ass. Let's go ride a bike, people! Oh my god, but like imagine I fell off the bike and like crashed into a hot guy. <laughs> I need to stop. But like imagine, and like he would catch me and I'd be like, oh, I'm so sorry. And he's like, whoa. And then we stare into each other's eyes and like electric fire explodes around us. Hey, bit. Sorry, I can't call you guys that. Hey, my fellow readers. This is my cute little bag. I'm really gonna be filling it. So we obviously need white and black. Oh, have I not washed my brushes in a while? That is very um, problematic of me. Um... My red is almost empty because I like to paint with primary colors. I love riding the bike. Anyways, it's very dark, very scary. Freaking scary. I keep singing Disney songs in my head because that's like the pro thing to do. Frozen, let it go. Just scream it. No one would come near you. You look fucking crazy. And like, who doesn't want to look crazy? I bought myself a monster. So cheers, everybody. That tastes really good. Let me get my book. That would be fucking smart. Like you would need to press it, right? But I do not have, a, I do not own a press. So that's great. I'm gonna take my sweatshirt off though because I don't want this to be dirty. Changing, you can't see me. So off camera changing. I need to take the book first, I'm so dumb. No, there it is. So this is gonna be very, well, great. I really hope, oh my gosh. What the hell am I doing? Why is the tape not working? I'm literally gonna lose my mind. Let's hope this doesn't, let's hope this doesn't break. Uh-oh, kind of scared, not gonna lie. Okay. I take the edge, very nice, very nice. And let's, oh, this is kind of scary. I really hope that this is a tape that I can pull up very easily. I really hope this isn't like a strong tape. Like, yes, a strong tape, but not a strong, strong tape, you know? Oh my God. Ah! Okay. There you go. 
we go. And now I just need to tape this side and then we can get painted. Then we can get painted. Then we can get started, I mean. I don't even know what could go wrong. We go like this. And now we like fixate this on both sides. <gasps> I think that is such a smart idea. Wait a nothing second. Okay. This definitely works. We just have to tie it somehow. No way, that totally just worked. I'm so proud of myself. Okay, okay. Just a tiny bit. I'm gonna use my squishy that is totally not clean. Oh gosh, I'm scared. Okay, there's no going back now. <gasps> uh oh, I got paint on my hand. I'm already done with one. Oh wow. Oh, this is intense. Okay, okay. <gasps> <gasps> That's a lot. Uh oh. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Fast, working, fast, working, fast, working, fast, working. Let me do it like this. This is, this seems smart. Oh gosh. I'm literally exerting so much pressure on here. We're literally such DIY queens right now. It's not even funny. Let's not do too much. That is a lot, anyways. <laughs> I like while this is drying, I'm just gonna sketch a bit like my idea for the Verity spine. Okay, ready for another fake scenario? <gasps> I don't think you are. Okay, this is the scenario. You are the new art student at this prestige university. You just got in and every year only like three to four students are accepted in this dark academic uh, secret society university, right? And you got accepted because you are not like other girls and you work hard. Anyways, you've already been like attending the school for the past four months and every single time you paint, you feel like someone is watching you. Like you always feel like there are eyes on you from behind and you see this shadow moving around you, but you never know who it is. Like, you know, there's a person that's watching you, but you, you, you can't find them. Fast forward a few more weeks, you're at the art store, okay? And you're looking for paint because you have this great idea in your head. You don't know what color you need, though. You have like an insect, but you don't know what exactly you want. Boom, a hand shoots out holding up a paint bottle. The voice goes, I think this is what you're looking for. You turn around and see the hottest guy you've ever seen in your entire life. And you're like, oh, how did you know I needed this? And he goes, oh, I've been watching you for the past couple of weeks and I know you kind of needed this. And then you, for some reason, aren't creeped out and are getting red flags. You are like, oh my god, a guy's paying attention to me. Ha ha ha. Please continue, even if it's slightly creepy and giving Joey Goldberg vibes, but whatever. So he obviously keeps helping you, and you become art partners. Fast forward a couple, fast forward a couple more weeks, you find out he's the son of like the president of this university. But the president of this university, his father does not want you to date him, okay? Like at all, because you're from the wrong side of town, and he's like rich, secret society. You know what I was saying, right? He's like from the Upper East Side, and you're. You're not, right? But you and him fight together and defeat like his father and happily ever after. Okay, guys, I have an idea on what I wanna do. I'm gonna be doing a one line painting and I'm gonna do it in a goldish greenish color. <coughs> Let's get started. Kind of like this, just like a bit more organized, but like a stack of books. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and ever. Okay, real talk now. The amount of times I had to re-sketch this stupid book is not even explainable because I kept slipping and my pencil then went in between the pages and they would like slightly break and I mm, I was so close to giving up. But I'm a city girl. City girls don't give up. City girls don't drop things. City girls don't do a lot of things that you do. This is the city girl like aesthetic. I don't even know if that aesthetic is a thing or not, and if I just invented that, but if I did, then this is a new aesthetic now. And I don't give up, but I almost did. Okay, I kind of like this. It's like a movement line into two books. Wait, no, we're actually, okay, two pieces of books. And then we're gonna do a bit of writing. Oh my God, this is so difficult. Literally, what am I doing? Okay, this is what we're gonna be working with today. And we're gonna literally be using a toothpick for this because there's no way I'm messing this up. For this, this is so difficult. I'm literally concentrating so hard right now. And I'm gonna do it in a goldish greenish color. Dot, 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 dot. The dotting is gonna take so long. This so far I've gotten so far. Great Medita, you're doing amazing. 
why did I decide to do this again? Oh yeah, I was bored. I think I messed up. Great, Medita. It's not that bad of a mess up, but it is a mess up. So we're gonna have to overpaint it with black real quick. I don't wanna mess up again. Oh my God, I think I went a bit too far. No. And continue dabbing and then, I'm not gonna call it a fail, but I am gonna call it a fail. <gasps> ah! My patience is wearing out. Ah! Kind of was confused about geography here. Uh, not geography, angles for a second. So this is what the second book looks like, and now we're gonna do a third one. Why did I think I was gonna be able to do three books tonight? I'm only on the first one yet. By the way, if you haven't read Verity, then this video is your sign to read Verity because the amount of disturbing scenes as well as overall fear I felt while reading this book as well as just anger, like you feel all emotions while reading this book, which makes a book more likable even if the ending isn't as likable because it is open and you need to make up your own theory. Anyways, overall Verity is a great thriller in my opinion and you will, you know, be disturbed. Um... You will get the heebie-jeebies while reading this, and who doesn't want to have the heebie-jeebies all the time? Oh! I know what I'm doing. Stupid. Literally slay. Okay, guys, want to see? This is what it looks like. Okay, well, how can I say this? This is not giving, okay, I like his Picasso. This is giving, Medita, were you a bit tired and didn't have enough energy to do this and you still decided to complete it anyways? Yes, that's exactly the energy I'm getting from this final artwork. It is not what it's supposed to be. Okay, please, for everybody who's watching this, this is what you should be imagining right now. Imagine this beautiful green ombre with like the yellow from the Verity in the title. And then in the middle, there's this really cute typing machine. Like, and just imagine that and not those three books that do not look like they should ever be shown to the world. Okay, let's carry on with the video and pretend that this didn't happen. We're just, please forget that there was a fail in here. We're gonna let it dry. Remember how I said in the beginning of the video I was gonna do Nightfall and Shot on Boat as well? That was a lot. I'm blowing it dry right now. I'm not blowing. <laughs> I am pushing air on it right now to dry it. It's gonna take forever. Seven to nine. I kind of expect it to completely fail, but this is not, this is like a, I'm gonna give this for my first try, like a C. I ripped a page. Maybe I'll give it a D. I should probably get like good pens, uh, good brushes for this. And using a toothpick takes a lot longer than I expected. Obviously there's no stroke behind it. No stroke. We're pretty far already. <gasps> oh no, I just ripped so much of a page. No, look what I just did. <gasps> this is definitely getting a D. Or a D minus! It's ripped it again! <gasps> I'm ripping the cover off. That was so satisfying. I finished with the redeem. Ugh. It could be better. It could be better. We're gonna we're gonna learn how to get better at this, okay? We're gonna learn through these challenges. But we're done for today. I can't do another book. It was fun. This is the end of my first bookish challenge ever. We're going to see where this carries us. I sadly didn't do Shadow and Bone, nor did I do Nightfall, but also at the same time, I'm happy I didn't do it because I definitely need to learn how to prove my skills before continuing with the other books. So yeah, um, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed me, like, you know, being very critical of my artic artistic skills. And if you did, um, enjoy this video, you know, you can press that little hand button with the thumb pointing upwards. And if you want to see more of my content, you can subscribe. Um, yeah, I hope you have a great evening, day, whatever time zone you're in. I don't know what you're doing right now. Um, pick up a book. You know, I mean, this is your sign to read Verity. Read Verity, very good thriller, you know, but only if you're like, you know, into that stuff. Have a great day, happy reading, and yeah, see you next time.